A big thank you to all of you who like, comment, subscribe and share my videos or through other means support this channel. You are what makes this channel grow and become a resource for other people to learn from. Enough about how awesome you are, back to the video. Welcome back. It is the first Tuesday of the month and like every first Tuesday of the month, Epic Games release a new rotation of free assets on their Epic Marketplace. To get these assets, all you need to do is go to the marketplace and go to the free section and free for the month, and you'll get to the section where the free assets are for the month. These assets are going to be free for this month, this month so if you pick them up now, you will have them in your uh, library afterwards. So you need to pick them up before the next rotation starts. In the rotation for February, we have a Simpoly Town Pack, we have the Character Body FX Volume 1 Pack, Modular Sci-Fi Village Pack, Bank Building Interior Modular Pack, and an Ultimate FPS Puzzle Kit. So let's take a closer look at these assets and see what they contain. First up, we have the Simpoly Town Pack made by Polyart 3D. This environmental pack consists of the buildings that you see over here. This is the overview map of the assets available in the pack. You see some staircases over there as well. And in addition to that, off here in the distance, you can see the road segments that make up uh, the roads of the pack. We also have umbrellas or traffic lights, barrels, pipes, and a lot of different uh, uh, signs. Uh, these are the trees that are contained in the pack and these are the vehicles in the pack. So there are four different variations of vehicles with some different colorations. So let's see what this can be created into. Here you can see the Simpoly Town Pack in action. Now it looks pretty crowded and pretty full of uh, items all around here. Uh, so you can see that you can build quite varied cities with the assets that you get in this pack. Um, they have a few different example maps set up. They have a day map, a night map, a pastel color day, a pastel color night, and then of course the overview map that we saw earlier. So this is essentially what you can expect to get from this pack. So this is the character body FX volume one pack. Now this is a pack that is centered around some Niagara visual effects that are being used along with a mannequin to form its shape. Uh, this is the demo map for the VFX uh, pack. It consists of a bunch of different effects being run on a mannequin skeletal mesh, uh, varying between about a dozen different effects. Uh, there's uh, bubbles, buttons, chains, coins, crystals, diamonds, fire, flowers, glass, glitter, light orbs, pixels, rocks, sticky notes, toilet paper, and twigs. And I have sped up the uh, sequence here that's being played to demonstrate these different types uh, so that you can get a more varied look about the different elements that they are using as effects. So this is something that you can uh, build upon, make some, uh, as the effects are right now, maybe they aren't the most useful ones, but uh, I'm sure that it can be pretty cool to look in under the hood and see how these different effects were made and also uh, change them up or possibly repurpose them for your own projects. Next up, we have the modular sci-fi village. This is the demonstration map consisting of the assets in action, showing off the different structures that you can create with the assets that is contained within. You also see a few different vehicles and some different props around the scene as well. Uh, overall, you can see that there is not a lot of difference and variation in the different assets and this becomes fairly clear as well once one goes into the preview map to see what assets are contained. Uh, they are not a whole lot, but if you're into sci-fi, then this might be something that could be of interest to you. Uh, you see you have a small assortment of props, windows, everything seems to be modular enough to do some variation of it at least. And yeah. This is created by RVC. 
Next up we have the bank building interior. This is a modular asset pack created by Learta Studios. Um, this pack consists of enough to create this interior uh, scene here of a bank. You can go back however and see that we are also inside of a bank building. Uh, not much more than that. So we have some furnishings inside of the building and you can go a little bit up to a top floor as well and see some uh, rooms up here as well. This studio, Learta Studios, creates uh, pretty nice looking and high quality assets when it comes to environments. Uh, this pack however might be one of their weakens, weaker ones in my opinion. It's very small uh, and the use for it is very limited uh, unless you wanted to repurpose this for something else that feels like a governmental building uh, instead of a bank. Uh, but yeah, the, the quality of the assets are high, uh, the asset pack itself is not that big. Last up in this month's bundle we have the ultimate first person shooter puzzle kit. So this is a blueprint centric uh, asset that is meant to uh, create for you some puzzle components that you can then make use of to create your own puzzles. Uh, sort of inspired by things like um, Portal and similar. Um, so how this works is you have a character in this is the demonstration map and you have uh, this touchpad over here which has a line drawn over there to the sign that says it's essentially uh, not connected and then if you move over it it uh, goes green and it opens up the path to the next room. However, you notice that you need to stay on the pad to keep it open. So you can pick up a box and place it on the touch pad and then you can pass through that way. And uh, yeah, that's in essence uh, the kind of puzzles that you have. You, In this room, for example, you can see that we have a laser beam and it's going through this uh, light and you can see that it passes on a green light over there. We have three other lines that we seem to be wanting to uh, color up. So we can grab this box over here and we can go here and we can have it intersect with the different uh, sort of uh, lamps around in the, the level. And once we have connected all of these lamps with their laser beams, then the path for us is open and we can pass through and go to the next level. You can see that there are like small explanations on the walls when it comes to the puzzles explaining sort of uh, parts of how, how things work in our setup. So uh, that is essentially what this pack is all about. And if we go and check, we can see that the pack consists of a folder called Blueprints. And here you have the sort of puzzle components that they have created for you. So you have on anti-field, you have buttons, you have cables, you have a cake, which is probably why it's portal inspired. Uh, click buttons, animations, doors, impulse panels, indicators, laser cubes, laser meters, inputs. You see, there's a bunch of different things here. And uh, I'm sure that even if these are not enough for all of your purposes, just having these available for you can give you inspiration how to create other similar or completely different ones as well uh, if puzzles are what's part of the project that you're working on. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you liked the video leave a like. If you did not like it leave a dislike. Leave any suggestions or comments you have down below. Subscribe and share this video if you want to see more like it in the future. That is all for now. Keep on learning. Take care.